School days can be full of struggles, but luckily there's a solution to every problem and in this video you will learn all of them. Ready? Let's go! I actually don't drink coffee, but I know that for many people starting the day with a cup of coffee is so important. If you're one of them and need to have your coffee in the morning, but at the same time you're always late for school, this hack is right up your alley. Instead of having your beloved coffee from a mug, try making coffee popsicles. It's so simple and saves a lot of time when getting ready in the morning. Pour your coffee in a bunch of popsicle molds. I'm using instant coffee, no judgment. Pop this in the freezer overnight and you have your to-go popsicles ready for the entire week ahead. Have one on the way to school and by the time you get there you'll feel super awake and refreshed. Having a piece of chocolate during breaks works as a great energy pick-me-up on a hectic school day. However, when you pull out your chocolate bar in school, something like this is very likely to happen. Can I have some? Sure. Thanks. You're the best! <sighs> and don't get me wrong, sharing is caring, but sometimes we just need to indulge with a bit of chocolate on our own and in peace. A great way to do that is sneaking a piece of chocolate in an eraser. Pull the eraser out of the cardboard wrapper like this. Now take your yummy chocolate bar that you want to oh, take to yeah. school. Since most erasers are white, I recommend going for white chocolate. And that's not a problem for me, because white chocolate has always been my favorite. All that's left to do is insert a piece of white chocolate inside the eraser wrapper. See how beautifully this one fits in? Yep, it took me some searching in the grocery mm, store to find yummy. the right chocolate for this hack and I definitely succeeded. Finally, you can enjoy your well-deserved sneaky piece of chocolate without being bothered. For those classmates that always want to take a bite of your lunch, here's a little funny prank. Take some grapes and a bag of candy drop. Unwrap the candy and set it aside. Now take a grape and wrap it in the candy wrapper. Voila, here we have our first grape candy and it looks completely legit. Let's make more of this and pull a little prank on our classmates. As they say, fruit is nature's candy, and personally, I love it more than sweets anyway. But we can definitely say that this girl won't be asking you for food again. <laughs> bottles are always so bulky and impractical. So many times I end up with a huge glue mess in my notebooks and this has to stop. No stress, with this hack it will for sure. I love these glitter glue bottles. Pick one, open it up and squeeze the glue inside an empty nail polish bottle. So cool, right? Fill the nail polish container up to the top with the sparkly glue. 
Now you have a much lighter, cooler and easier to apply glue to take to school. The nail polish applicator works so well and applies just the right amount of glue exactly where we need it. Not to mention how cute, small and practical these glue nail polish bottles are. You can throw them in your pencil case and have them with you to school without adding too much additional weight to your already heavy backpack. A fun and handy hack you definitely need to try. I love to doodle in my notebooks, but then I end up using all the pages in my notebook for funny drawings instead of serious notes. Luckily, I have an epic idea that will save all our notebook pages, but still give us unlimited space for our doodles and other creative activities. Take a notebook and get ready to cut out a piece of the front cover. Using a ruler and an X-Acto knife, make four straight cuts about two centimeters from the notebook edge. Now you can take the centerpiece out like that. Grab some double-sided tape and stick four pieces on the inner side of the cover. Time to take an acetate sheet and stick it on. We're basically transforming our notebook in an eraser board. But besides being super cool and practical, we want it to be very pretty too. So stick a piece of beautiful craft paper or a printout of your choice on top of that acetate sheet. Here we have it, an amazing erase board notebook. You can write and erase your doodles and drawings using a simple whiteboard marker. To make the experience even cooler, stick a medium-sized pom-pom to the marker like this. Now you're ready to make drawings and notes on your notebook cover and erase them without getting your hands dirty. This is seriously so much fun! Write your to-do list on your notebook and when you accomplish them, simply use the back of the marker to erase the task. It is really convenient and also very sustainable because you'll save a lot of paper. This hack is 100% Mother Earth approved and I love it! <laughs> Okay, so I noticed that pencil eyeliners and lip liners look very similar to the rounded coloring pencils. And with a simple trick, we're gonna make them look exactly the same. To transform a black pencil eyeliner into a coloring pencil, we need a black permanent marker. Color the entire eyeliner with it in order to remove all the headings and captions. Our eyeliner looks just like a black coloring pencil, so we can take it to school without a worry on our mind. You can also use nail polish to cover your eyeliners and lip liners. I wanna paint this lip liner in red. In order to achieve this, let's first cover it with white nail polish. We need to do this because black is the strongest color and painting red directly on top may not turn out opaque enough. That's why applying a white base is super helpful. As you can see the red nail polish looks very bright and opaque on top of it. That's exactly what we needed. Apply a coat or two and you're all set. Mix your makeup pencils with a bunch of rounded coloring ones. So amazing right? They look exactly the same. You can do this for your brow pencils or even the jumbo eyeshadow pencil. There's literally so many options. I like to use the black eyeliner to define my eyes, especially when I want a bit more smudgier look. I love wearing red lip liner instead of lipstick. It's actually way more long lasting than many lipsticks and when you're wearing a bright color like red, that's exactly what you want. Sarah, what's that on your lips? Lips? Mm -hmm. mm, nothing, they're naturally like that. Oh, I wish I had lips like that. <laughs> Can I have one? Me too! Not just chocolate, gum is also one of these super desired things that everyone wants, right? Where can we hide our gum so that no one will notice? A pen? No, no, we're gonna use a package of ink cartridge. Take your favorite gum and open up the package. Next, you just wanna replace three ink refills with the yummy gum. Leave a couple of ink cartridges in the package because you need to have a few spare ones to write your notes with. Don't get me wrong, sharing with your friends is always a nice thing to do. <laughs> but sometimes tricks like this can be very handy and there's nothing wrong with having some sneaky gum here and there. Oh yeah! 
You know those times when you get so hungry during classes and your tummy starts making those funny rumbling noises? I've definitely been there and it felt pretty awkward. The easiest way to avoid this funny struggle is to have a quick snack on hand. This one is seriously so easy and convenient. Take a packet of coloring pencils that doesn't have any opening at the front. Take all the coloring pencils out and you have lots of free space to hide your favorite snack inside. The best is to go for something healthy like nuts and seeds, but I find those gummy ropes in my grocery shop and the package was just perfect to fit inside the coloring pencils box, so I had to go for this. Very sneaky and convenient when you need a boost of energy. And remember to only have a small treat every day, on general, always opt for healthy and nutritious food. This is not happening again. We gotta find a better way to hide our nail file and the back of a ruler seems like a perfect spot. Take a glue gun and apply a stripe of hot glue at the back side of the ruler. While the glue is still soft, place on a nail file and you're free to shape your nails during class. I mean, who says we girls can't multitask? We're totally able to listen to teachers' lectures while taking care of the manicure, am I right? And when you need to make a straight line in your notebook, your ruler will still work as new. nail shape is of course a foundation of a beautiful manicure, but a pretty nail polish on top is just as important. And sneaking a nail polish to school is a piece of cake when your nail polish looks like a usual whiteout. Take a correction fluid bottle and compare it to your nail polish bottles. Which one has the most similar shape? I think this one. The bottles have similar sizes and this nail polish is just out of this world gorgeous. So sparkly and pretty. Alright, it's makeover time. Carefully remove the sticker from the whiteout bottle. Place it on a flat surface with a sticky side facing up. Grab the nail polish bottle and roll it over the sticker to attach it on perfectly. How simple it was to create a whiteout filled with a gorgeous glittery nail polish, right? Your nails will be thankful for sure. It looks beautiful on its own or as a top coat over any other color. Use this idea to sneak your favorite nail polish to school and get yourself an amazing mani while listening to your teacher's lectures. Still can't get over how stunning this correction fluid looks. Find me a more glitzy glam whiteout, I'll wait. <laughs> news i just uploaded a brand new epic diy clothes video on my second channel so make sure to watch it and subscribe Mwah. bye bye